All right, Seth Ulrich, welcome to an episode of Pastor in a Cart Getting Coffee. Of all the episodes I've done, this is the best coffee. Coffee, sometimes it's Diet Coke. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Seth, on every episode, I, I get a shirt that represents, you know, kind of the person. This is my Seth Ulrich shirt. Um, and this, for people that really know you, this is perfectly descriptive because you are one of the smartest people I know. You, you are. And, and, you know, there's book smart, technical, mechanical, you pour through manuals. Crazy smart in all different kinds of ways. Uh, smart guy. And so this is my Seth shirt because <laughs> you talk in a language sometimes I don't even understand. And you use your talent for the Lord to do great art. Tons of interesting things about you that people don't know. Okay. Um, first one, we're related. You're my cousin. How many cousins are there? There's, I think, 19 first cousins, 30s of second cousins. Awesome. We come from an awesome family. Love Grandma and Grandpa, their commitment to the gospel. You grew up with uh, Uncle Donald, like I did. Yep. You tell, tell the story about how you got your first sound system. Well, Uncle Donald upgraded the sound system at the church. And, okay. Um, instead of, you know, scrapping the old one, he said, do you want this? And I said, yep. <laughs> so what'd you do with your first sound system? Uh, I used it a lot for garage band for my brother and my sister and I would put on shows for them in the garage and they would perform and I would run tech <laughs> and we would funny story is one time we wanted to add haze to the environment so we I took a bunch of drywall dust and put it into a shop vac <laughs> and reversed it so the shop vac blew out the drywall dust it worked well but everybody was coughing so that was fun <laughs> that's a great story <laughs> Um, yeah, so uh, then I ended up using it at a church for their youth program. Okay. Um, they didn't have a sound system for the room they were in, and I was like, well, I've got one. Mm -hmm. So every week I would pack it up and take it to the little room we were meeting in and run sound and have sound for the youth yeah. group. So. You grew up at the racetrack. Oh, yeah. What did you do at the racetrack? Uh, I helped with the crew, uh, <laughs> just helping my Uncle Royal. On working on the car. You you make it sound like the pit crew had a lot of people. What did the pit crew comprise of? Royal Judy and myself. Sometimes my cousin Wendy. <laughs> so, our younger cousin Wendy, yep. Royal's wife Judy, our aunt Judy, yep. and you. Pretty so you're pretty much the pit crew boss at Colorado <laughs> National Speedway. Yes. Growing up on Saturday, yep. that was Saturday nights. Yep. Saturday nights going on the racetrack. I love it. Yep. So uh, you came to work at CIY at a really young age. So yeah, I just loved it so much and I just wanted to learn as much as I could. So put myself in every situation I could to learn. And Johnny gave me the opportunity to run lights one time and said, if you screw this up, you don't have another op like you won't have another opportunity. Well I screwed it up really bad and he was gracious. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So. But I, I turn around one day you're a kid on the tour lugging boxes around and the next day everyone's like, Well Seth's packing the truck. Well, Seth's in charge of that. Well, Seth got a rigging license. Well, Seth ties us in. And it's like overnight, you were getting credentials and running the tour. And then before long, you were like one of the top production managers um, for tours at CIY. Mm -hmm. And uh, did a lot with uh, the No Sweat program and uh, Engage. And was so proud to see your work at CIY. And then I called you, uh, and I believe God called you, back to local ministry. Yep. Like the first week there, he's like, I have, I've got a girl for you. But I'm like, which girl? Because I was super confused because I had asked about this girl prior and Johnny said, oh, Elle, don't worry about her. She's too good for you. <laughs> yeah. 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 We're, so, we're testing the situation out. So, yeah, it was, I was like, what girl are you talking about? Well, it was the girl that's too good for me. <laughs> so, so God blessed you with the wife. Yep. God's recently blessed you with Lenny. Yeah, little Lenya, our baby daughter. I call her Lenny. I know, a lot of people do that. I don't know people, so. So here at the church, God's got you doing lots of things. Just kind of tell folks kind of what some of your callings are here right now. Yeah, so I'm creative arts team lead, so I oversee all the sound, video, lighting, and worship leaders. Um, and then I also um, am doing IT work and tech work. You oversee all facilities. Facilities, operations, stuff. So so all, all stuff that you've got in your background and your past that you can do. Uh, if you want to, I mean, there's lots of ways you can come and volunteer and work with Seth. Use your gifts. Uh, Seth, one of his specialties is special projects. You know, we're just like, hey, 
Um, we're gonna build something that's crazy. <laughs> One time you helped build uh, a grown man racing tricycle, yep. and we were ramping it over fire. Yes. Kind of. Fake fire <laughs> that never looked like fire. Real fire. <laughs> and just, Seth's great at special projects. I, I guarantee you this. Whatever gifting you have, uh, whatever talents you have, there's, there's Seth's the guy that can probably plug it in. So just get to know him. Um, you know, I, your email and all your contact information and a ton of the stuff is going to be in the live chat of this video. And uh, people, when they come, we, we, work, we love to work hard, but we have a lot of fun. Yeah. And we have tons of places for people to plug in. Carpenters, electricians, plumbers. There's almost no guild that we can't um, put, put into use in God's kingdom here at yep. the church. A pool guy. Our baptistry is looking rough. <laughs> right? There's all kinds of things. <laughs> Test us. Test us. If you do something like, oh, yeah, I specialize in this, give, give us a shot. We'll yep. figure it out. Yep. Uh, we're, we're here to help you use your gifts. And uh, there's tons of places to serve. So that's one of the guys on staff that could help make that happen. So thanks for being here. Yep. Thanks for loving the Lord. Um, thanks for using your gifts in this in this church. Yeah, Thank you, Seth. We're glad he's on the team. <laughs>